Hi everyone, for today's video I will be fixing the ice dispenser in my refrigerator. As you can see right now when I try to get ice from the ice dispenser, you can only hear the motor running but nothing is coming out. There are different reasons for this issue. You can have issue with the motor assembly, ice maker not producing ice, ice bucket not seated properly or the most common issue is freezer temperature getting warmer causing the ice to stick together and getting stuck preventing the motor from turning. This usually happens when you accidentally left the door open for a longer period or leaving the door slightly open. First thing you want to do is check if the ice bucket is seated properly. I would do this by moving the lever from side to side. If the bucket is not seated properly, doing this will adjust the bucket into the right spot. Since my ice bucket is seated properly and the ice does not seem to be sticking together, I'll remove the bucket first and check to make sure that there is no ice stuck in the chute. As you can see right now, a lot of ice is stuck in the chute. This is usually caused by the chute door not closing properly. This rarely happens because the chute door closes very slowly to let all the ice come out but there are some rare occasions where an ice will not fall fast enough and will block the chute door and leave it open for a while until it causes some of the ice that is left to stick together. You can melt this ice by simply turning the freezer off. You can also use a fan or a hair dryer to melt the ice quickly. But for me, since I'm familiar with how the chute looks like, I will just use a knife to break the ice and hopefully I'll be able to pull or push all the ice out. Okay, so I was now able to break the ice down. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take them out and throw them away and clean this whole thing out. Not sure if you can see this clearly, but you see the chute door is closing slowly. So that's how it actually works to make sure that the ice have enough time to come out of the chute. I transfer the ice into a different container to inspect the bucket. And as you can see, there's also ice buildup at the bottom of the bucket. You want to remove this ice as well. To do this, I'll simply put it under a running water to melt and remove the ice quickly. You can see the ice is quickly melting. Now I can easily remove them. And make sure that you wipe it dry before you put all the ice back in. Okay, so I just put the ice back in. Now let's go ahead and test it. As you can see, ice is now coming out of the ice dispenser. I hope that this video is helpful to you. Please make sure to click the like and the subscribe button to help my channel. And thank you for watching.